Hello everyone, welcome to Infigyan. In this very very exciting video of algebraic challenging equations where we are going to solve today one very interesting factorial equation. Equation is x factorial plus x plus 1 factorial plus x plus 2 factorial equal to x plus 2 whole power 4 over 8 where x belongs to positive integer. So let's get started by writing recursive formula in factorial notation. So if recursive formula is there, then what we'll write n factorial can be written as n times n minus 1 factorial or we can also write n times n minus 1 times n minus 2 factorial and so on if needed. So now we will apply this recursive formula at two places here and here. Let's apply x factorial unchanged plus x plus 1 times x factorial using recursive formula. In third term we will write the same x plus 2 times x plus 1 times x factorial. Again recursive formula equal to x plus 2 whole power 4 divided by 8. Okay, now you can see x factorial, x factorial, x factorial. We will take x factorial common. What is left? 1 plus x plus 1, okay, plus x plus 2, x plus 1, equal to x plus 2 whole power 4 divided by 8. If I will add both these two terms, first two terms, then I will get x plus 2 again. So I will write in bracket x plus 2 plus x plus 2 times x plus 1. Okay. Equal to x plus 2 raised to the power 4 divided by 8. Now again I will take x plus 2 common out. So what will be left? x factorial times x plus 2 in bracket it would be 1 plus x plus 1. RHS would be as it is x plus 2 whole power 4 divided by 8. Now I will write final simplification x plus 2 and this bracket is also x plus 2 so shall I write x plus 2 whole square and RHS is x plus 2 whole power 4 divided by 8. Now as you can see from here it is x factorial. So the domain will start from x greater than or equal to 0. Okay. That's why I can cancel these two powers. Okay. A square will be left as you can write here x not equal to minus 2 because it is not feasible. So what is left after that? Let me write x factorial equal to x plus 2 whole square over 8. x plus 2 whole square over 8. So 8 I will write here. Now again I will use recursive formula. So I will write 8 times x times x minus 1 factorial equal to x let me open using algebraic identity a plus b whole a square that is equal to a square plus 2ab plus b square so right side would be x square plus 4x plus 4 okay now i will divide both sides by x now first we have to verify whether what will happen to the equation when x is equal to 0. So let me write 0 factorial plus 1 factorial plus 2 factorial. It should be 2 power 4 divided by 8. If it is so then we cannot divide. So let me check 0 factorial is 1, 1 factorial is 1, 2 factorial is 2. Right hand side 16 over 8. So left hand side is 4, 
right hand side is 2 so it cannot be equal so x not equal to 0 so we can divide both sides by x so 8 x minus 1 factorial equal to x plus 4 plus 4 over x as x cannot be equal to 0 okay now logical arguments let us consider the lhs x must be greater than or equal to 1 as it is given x is non negative positive integer not neither 0 nor negative okay so x is greater than or equal to 1 now come to the rhs this is positive integer now this has to be positive integer so one thing is clear that point number 1 x must be less than or equal to 4. If x is exceeding 4, then this would be fractional value. So, x must be less than or equal to 4. Second point, x should be the multiple of 4 less than 4. So, what I will write, the possible eligible x value will be 1, 2, 3 and 4. Once you will consider this 3, then that will make 4 over 3 which is 1 plus 1 over 3 fractional value will come so this value we will reject okay so what is conclusion from here we can conclude 1 2 and 4 are eligible or possible solutions possible solutions so now we have to check for this equation we can check here i can put or here also you can put so let us put 1 2 and 4 in this equation 8 times x factorial equal to x plus 2 whole square equal to x plus 2 whole square three values first x is equal to 1 x is equal to 2 x is equal to 4 check which value will satisfy so okay i am putting x equal to 1 so 8 times it is times 1 factorial equal to 1 plus 2 whole square okay for x is equal to 8 calculation left hand side is 1 factorial is 1 lhs is 8 rhs is 9 so not equal so this cannot be rejected Now come to x is equal to 2. I will write 8 times 2 factorial equal to 2 plus 2 whole square. So 2 factorial is 2. So 16 equal to 16. This is verified. So x equal to 2 is accepted solution. Now third case. x equal to 4. If I will put that, then 8 times 4 factorial is equal to 6 whole square. 4 plus 2 is 6. 8 times 4 factorial, that is 24. 24 times 8, 192. Equal to 36. Not true. So, this is also rejected. So, first one is rejected. x equal to 4. The last one is rejected. This one is accepted. So let's verify whether it is true or not. So I will write verification. Okay. Let's put in this original equation. So I will write 2 factorial plus x plus 1, 3 factorial plus x plus 2, 4 factorial equal to 2 plus 2, 4 power 4 over 8. 2 factorial is 2, 3 factorial is 6, 4 factorial is 24. So LHS is 32. Now come to RHS. 4 power 4 we can write. It is 4 power 2 times 4 power 2. So 16 times 16 over 8. So I will cancel this. So I will be having 32 in the RHS also. That means it is true. So our final solution for the given factorial equation will be x is equal to 2. I hope you like this video. Thank you so much for watching. Do not forget to like, share, subscribe. Bye-bye till next video. Please take care yourself.